Hello and welcome to Two Minutes of Anatomy. I am Dr. Donald Lozello of Championship Chiropractic in Las Vegas, Nevada. The medial pterygoid muscle and the lateral pterygoid muscle are classified as primary muscles of mastication. Mastication is the medical name for chewing. The medial pterygoid muscle has two heads, a deep head and a superficial head, while the lateral pterygoid muscle also has two heads called the upper and the lower head. The medial pterygoid muscle is a thick rectangular muscle with a superficial and a deep head. The superficial head originates on the maxillary tuberosity of the inferior maxilla. The deep head is larger than the superficial head and originates on the medial surface of the lateral pterygoid plate of the sphenoid bone. The medial pterygoid muscle fibers converge inferiorly, forming a tendon that inserts on the medial ramus of the mandible posterior and inferior to the myohyoid groove of the mandible. The medial hyoid muscle functions to assist with elevation and protrusion of the mandible. It also assists the lateral pterygoid muscle with side-to-side -side mandibular motions. The lateral pterygoid muscle has two parts, the upper head and the lower head. The origin of the upper head is the inferior temporal surface of the greater wing of the sphenoid bone. The lower head originates from the lateral aspect of the lateral pterygoid plate of the sphenoid bone. The muscles converge inferiorly, forming a tendon that inserts on the condylar process of the mandible along with the articular disc and the capsule of the temporal mandibular joint. The lateral pterygoid muscle functions as the sole muscle of mastication to cause depression of the mandible. It actively opposes the other muscles of mastication and allows for depression of the mandible. It also assists with protrusion and side-to-side -side movement of the mandible.